So we're back here, Becky Bullseye. Uh, we have just finished speaking with silence. So the next big quest we have is hard answers. We gotta go talk to Enther. But before we do that, I'm gonna get two of these little side quests done. The Thieves Guild side quests. Um, I believe we have our fifth one in solitude now, so we'll be able to uh, do the solitude. Uh, Sorry, uh, the solitude special job. I always forget the name of them. Let's put on our Eve stuff. What do you need? I don't want anything from you, Alakir warrior. Okay, so let's go do some pickpocketing. So apparently, pickpocketing guys, you can't get over ninety percent success rate. You just kind of have to pray, which is a little bit annoying, but it's part of doing business. Quick save, obviously. <laughs> Worth it, just because otherwise you can uh, you can cost yourself a quest and a lot of load time and stuff. I was the newest companion until you came along. Oh, that's cool. I guess that's okay. This means I can show you the ropes. Cool. That's who I need to pickpocket, by the way. Uh, oh, crap. Perfect. Got a ring next. I find it annoying that you can't get like 100%. I feel like you should be able to get 100% if you're like super stealthy. If they're asleep too. If they're asleep, I think you should be able to get up to 100%. Uh, Alright, the heist job. So, Solitude Stables. Which is not the Solitude Stables. It's Catalyst Farm. But, yeah. They say murdered the High King. Yeah, he did. Oh, wow. I guess it is kind of the Solitude Stables, but it's at Callus Farm. So, to tell you the truth, guys, I have never been in this building. Ever. I don't even know what this is. No. No, I'm looking to steal your shiz, bud. It's crazy the things we, you know, play Skyrim for so long, and you still just don't end up in places, because... Oh, wow. Look at all this stuff, guys. <laughs> Dope. I don't even need to steal from this, because I think I gave her... Oh, I need to steal the gems, so... though. Hmm. Because I think I... Because I gave Catleth potatoes earlier in this thing, I can take... Wow, you can take all these, too? Oh, that's good to know. It's good to know that there's all those ingots in there you can take, I think, if you just become buddies. I assume that this is because I gave her potatoes or leeks or whatever earlier. I don't think this has anything to do with the, uh... Sorry, this has anything to do with, uh... Oh. I will do something. I will kill this ancient dragon. Um, I don't have anything to do with becoming the Thane of... Or being close to becoming the Thane. Alright, potions. Take, a uh, Marksman potion. Ancient dragons are a lot stronger than regular dragons, guys, so it's gonna be a little bit of a pain in the neck, but it's also a really awkward spot because, like I've said in the past, he doesn't have a place to land. Oh, is he gonna land right here? No. Let's see. And what'll happen, which I hope doesn't happen, is he might take off. Yeah. He might fly up there, see a bear or something, start fighting the bear, and then not come back here, and you waste all this time. Yeah, sure. Oh, missed him. Is that your best? Come back here, dragon. Yeah, see, he still hasn't even landed once. That doesn't hurt. Tickling me, dragon. Tickling me. Tickles? More tickles. Oh. I think my better bow damage potion wore out. I should use another one in a second here. As soon as I get... As soon as he stops, I'll use another one. Yeah, it's two. Okay. Yeah. 
starting to hurt him pretty bad. Where'd he go? Oh wow, he did find a place to land. I love it. One more. One more. Got him. I think that's why we're really heavy. I think I have a bunch of dragon bones and scales on me. Yeah, okay, we need to dip those at our house. Which is convenient that it's in solitude because we are right here. Uh, um, no, I don't want to travel. So make sure I absorb the soul. Although I think it'll follow you. Don't get too close. Free dragon soul, sweet. Alright, now we'll go to our house and empty out our character. Just get rid of the dragon bones and scales and some of the ingredients we've collected. Oh, my house isn't that way. House is this way, boys and girls. Do I have any shouts? Oh, do I have whirlwind spring? Oh, I do. Nice. Actually, no, 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 no. Let's, uh, let's unlock Mark for Death. That'll make it a little easier to kill dragons. I really did want to get uh, Whirlwind Sprint though. Mark for Death just good for killing dragons. I really, I still haven't sorted my stuff out, guys. I know everything's just kind of freaking flopped in here. And this, this one barrel can just hold everything, apparently. Yep. Um, ebony ingot can go in there. Got a lot of gems on me. A lot of gems. Uh, okay, that's good. And the ingredients, and then we're good. Where have I been storing my ingredients, guys? Over here. Actually, we're going to do this now because I continuously forget fire salts. Where are my fire salts? We're taking 10. We're going to go to Balamond when we go to return these quests. Um, yeah, perfect. Perfect. So I'm going to return these quests before I go talk to Enther. And then we will go see Enther and discuss with him about Gal uh, decoding Gallus' journal. So we can find out what really happened. Between Mercer Frey and Carlia. Okay, Balan. Come here, big fella. What's the hoodie? Come to Smithing's. The secret is my forge. Well, it was. Sadly, this forge is dying. Would ten pinches of fire salt help? These must have been very hard to come by. You've saved my business. <laughs> well, I've been playing for twenty-five hours, and I found seventeen. So. Oh wow! You get fifteen hundred gold for that. That's quite a. That's quite a reward. Oh. Might as well sell some of my gems. Look like, how much these diamonds are worth. Like, we can't even afford to... We can't... We can barely afford to touch or selling any of our gems. Greetings. Everything I've got on display, really. Uh, do we have anything else stupid that we need to sell? Glass shield. Uh, Steve skilled armor. Steel arrows for some reason. Safe travels, Landstrider. Okay. You gonna stick everything I've got on display, really? Yeah, Grok, I know. Here, take a little bit of a. Actually, don't take a tip here. Take a Debella statue and a an emerald. How about that? 50k. Come back when you're ready to spend more. Not even hard. All right. Down to the thieves guild. Turning these two quests, and then we're gonna go talk to Enter. Turning these two quests. Get new ones. Um, I think actually, guys, I think we might only be able to get one now. Because as soon as we turn in the Solitude quest, it's going to want us to do the Favor quest. So, which one is the Solitude quest? That's Vex. So, I want to talk to Delvin first and see if he'll give me another job first. Sometimes they won't. They really want those stupid special quests done before everything else. Which is nice. Like, it gets, you know, it's going to give us places to sell our gems. So, Delvin first. You don't watch it, or they actually start to respect you. Thank you. I handled the breakings of all your 
Now give me some fishing jobs. So we're gonna make sure we don't get one in solitude or in uh, Riften. So let's see what it says. White run. White run's fine. Perfect. Steal anything? I suppose you want your share now. Here you go. Yeah, I do want my share. Thank you. I handle the burglary. Oh, what? That's weird. I thought I did five jobs in solitude. Maybe. Maybe you can't. Huh. I have just the place. The owner likes to stash some loot. Fine. That's weird. I thought I did five jobs in solitude. Maybe I'm miscounting. Mark Arthur. Okay, that's fine. Huh. I wonder if I've either I've either miscounted guys or I. Uh, oh. Oh, come on. Huh. I can't even become a mer I can't even do the merchant thing until I trade in. Oh, come on. God damn it. Yeah, so maybe I miscounted. Maybe I haven't done any in, uh, done five in solitude. I thought I had, though. So, there's one in solitude. Two in solitude. Three in solitude. Four in solitude. Five in solitude, yeah. I'm definitely counting correctly, huh? I wonder if I can't do. I wonder if there's like a. Huh. I wonder if I have to already be done the Thesial quest line before they start giving me the favor quests. If they do, that's fine. We're working on it every video, so. Let's go talk to Enther. I'm pretty sure he's gonna send us to a dungeon to clear out, so. That could be a pain in the neck, but whatever. It's not just as so easy. Let's just talk to Enther and he'll translate the journal. Let's talk to Enther and go and uh, you know, go and find a thing that will help us recover it. I mean, translate Gallus's journal. Oh, perfect, Falmer. As we all know, I love Falmer and choruses, guys. Fierce guardian of his research. Can I help you with anything else? Oh, fine. All right, so I have to go talk to Salmo, and I think I have to get access to the Dwemer Museum. But I think because we're already buds with him, it's not gonna be a problem. Like we've killed Nimi, and we've also uh, we also did the Book of Love for him, and got him in love with his girlfriend Faleen. They're probably doing the dirty old people thing right now. That was weird. As soon as this loaded them, I like a Markarth guard was like, I wonder why we do that. Hmm. Let's put on our. Uh... Actually, I'm gonna remember this. I have a heist job in Markarth to do before I for. Don't want to forget that before I leave Markarth. The big guy. I'm calling it Calselmo's Guide to Phosphorus. You must be mad to think I'd allow anyone to see it before it's completed. I've already provided you a key to the museum. You should consider it an honor. You are allowed to browse my collection. I'm sorry, but that's as far as my generosity extends. Oh, well, I have a key to the museum, so that's weird. But, even though I go inside here, I'm not allowed to uh, see what he's talking about or whatever. Because I've already been in here. When we've been in here, I stole the hammer from here. You know, blah, 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 blah. A dozen. I am the new member of the Companions. Oh, I actually have to pick a lock to get in here. Lucky for me, picking locks is... Oh, never mind, I don't need to pick a lock. The museum key opens us. So I think inside here, there are guards, and they're going to go hostile on me, but we'll see. What we got over here? Yeah, see, everything's marked steel. 
creep along. People start getting hostile. We'll start pop bopping punks. Yeah, see? Kill any intruders on site. I'm right in front of him, he can't even see me. Oh, that guy got hit in the dome. Another one to the dome? Dead. So, we killed a Markarth's guard. And a wizard's guard. One of the arrows I missed that I fired. Okay. I don't think it's over here. I'm just... Maybe it is over here. Let's look at the map here. No, it's showing that I need to go way over the other side. up there okay oh maybe I was going the right way guys all right looks like I was empty soul gem uh oh I think this spider will like follow me now yeah huh neat I don't really care to control the stupid spider, but that's kind of cool. There's lots of Dwemer metal in here, too. I'm not going to pick any of it up. It's just going to weigh me down. The problem with picking up Dwarven and Dwemer metal <laughs> for us is we need the... Uh... Boom, dead. Boom, dead. Is you need the uh, Dwarven smithing perk in order to make Dwarven bows, which is one of the best ways to level smithing. But because you need both those things, um, it's a pain in the butt. Because I'm not going to... I don't want to do that. I don't want to level that up all the way. Let's drop a quick save just because I don't have auto save turned off. Better to be safe than sorry. Yeah, see. Plus it's all steel. If it wasn't all merch steel, maybe I could pick up some of it and sell it. I don't like the looks of this. That dude's dead. Nah, no one's here. Everybody just died for no reason, no one's there. So I like these areas. And the guards are easy to dispatch. Level up or sneak by getting all kinds of sneak attacks. Those are huge dwarven spheres, by the way. Much bigger than normal dwarven spheres. Oh, there's this wizard guy. I want him. Um, bow damage potion. Dead. Dead. Is he not dead? Okay. Well, that's the guy who I stole his control rod. Oh, yeah. This cube is, uh... I almost forgot. That I, I, I realized as soon as I saw it, I was like, that cube is the thing that we need to give to uh, Delvin from this area. Gotta remember, guys, I want all those. I want to have the Thieves Guild pimped out. It's gonna be sweet looking. Okay, so. This isn't an, isn't an extremely complicated part, but uh, if you've never done it before, some people have historically had struggles with it. Um, how do I get over there? What the hell? So, Kasamo Stone. You have to figure out. You got to you got to take down the information on it. No one in here. You're not alive, are you?
Um, so the way you do that is you grab charcoal and a roll of paper. Ta -da. Yeah, so you grab these two things and it will uh, it will etch it onto there for you. But the moment you do that, the moment you do that, there is uh, ooh, a chest actually. There's a bunch of goons that come in and try to kill you, so kind of like they heard you chalking the paper, or charcoaling the paper, I don't know. But yeah. Okay. Yeah, so as soon as you come up to here, you go boom. Charcoal removed, roll of paper removed, return to enter. See? Actually, let's use a dead. No, 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 yes, like this. All right, they're all dead. I don't think you have to kill them. I think you could probably sneak your way in and out if you really wanted to, but... Oh, there's still somebody alive? I thought I killed you all. Oh. Cool. Oh, this is how you get up there where they're jumping across. I see. So they were going to have to come up and filter through that door. So I guess you could have just waited up behind there, crouched, and run off. Because... Yeah, they weren't, uh... Look at this guy. Right in the dome. Yeah, because they were going to probably come up and around. Huh. Alright, let's get out of here now. So I think it just lets you out here, because now you're in Markar, so you can fast travel. But I don't want to fast travel. <laughs> I want to go down. Oh, can you not jump off this? Is this one of those things? Yeah, it's not going to let me jump off this. Whatever. Turn to enter. Why is it showing that he's in the... Oh. What? Alright, I guess I can't fast travel from here? What? Huh. Okay. Guess I gotta exit the, uh... The old-fashioned way. I don't know why it showed me as detected. I was on a balcony and there's nobody else there but whatever oh here's the bar door sweet so I don't think I'll have any trouble in here because I'm, I'm buddies with Kasama hey guys what's up bozos Alright, well, this, this works out anyways. We gotta go to the Hag's Cure to, uh, steal something, or whatever. We got our Mark Earth quest. Heist job in Hag's Cure. I like the heist jobs. The heist jobs are good. Because they just break into a business. So you can kind of just wait till it's nighttime and the business will be closed or whatever. Some people never leave their goddamn house, and if you have to break into their house, it's a pain in the neck. I wonder if what's going to happen is I'm going to become Master of the Thieves Guild, and the moment I do, it's going to um, give me all those quests. I'm trying to remember where the lockbox was in here. Put my bow away. No one's going to be fighting me in here. Oh, wow. I'm legit going to have to like sneak up between their beds. Anything good on you, Bothella? A jug of milk. Those are actually pretty decent, but I'm not taking them. It's only an apprentice log. This should be child's play. There we go. I'm going to actually do one little thing in here. Just because all of her stuff is respawned and we're buddies with her. I'm going to check these three alchemy barrels. Just because you can get it. Like five, you can get up to five of ingredients, and some really good ones are there. Okay, cool. Cool, cool. Oh, 
im Sturm. Ja. Cool. Alright, let's return to Enther and we'll uh, finish off this quest. Um, okay, Enther. Still just hanging out at the uh, the Frozen Hearth. That's, I believe, the name of the tavern here. Or what? You know I'm the last Dragonborn? Maybe one day I'll have to install a mod so I can fustroad out the kids and actually hurt them a little bit. Hi, boys and girls. You're both so cute. Understand. Now let me take a good look at this. Over here, please. Okay. Hmm. Intriguing, but highly disturbing. It appears that Gallus has suspicions about Mercer Frey's allegiance to the guild for months. Oh. Gallus had begun to uncover what he called an unduly Lifestyle, the fleet was spending vast amounts of gold on personal pleasures. Does the journal say where this wealth came from? Yes, Gallus seems certain that Mercer had been removing funds from the guild's treasury without anyone's knowledge. Anything else, Enther? Anything about nightingales? Hmm. Yes, here it is. The last few pages seem to describe the failure of the Nightingales, although it doesn't go into great detail. Gallus also repeatedly mentions his strong belief that Mercer desecrated something known as the Twilight Sepulchre. Shadows preserve us, so it's true. I, I'm not familiar with the Twilight Sepulchre. What is it? What, what's Mercer Frey done? I'm sorry, Enther. I can't say. All that matters is we deliver your translation to the guild immediately. Farewell, Enther. Words can't be expressed. It's all right, Kalaya. You don't have to say a word. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Listen. All I do whatever you can, and I'd consider it a personal favor. Okay. If trying to rid yourself of stolen goods becomes a burden and you find yourself in Winterhold, visit me at the college. So he will become another one of our fences. Items of questionable interest from time to time, and I'll see what I can do. Perfect. Speak to Carlyle. If you have further need, we must hasten to Richard before Mercer can do any more damage to the guild. We've come this far, so I see no. The Twilight Sepulchre is the temple to Noctilia. It's what the Nightingales are sworn to protect with their lives. Everything that represents nocturnal influence is contained here. Now it seems Mercer's broken his oath with nocturnal and defiled the Can't break your oath with nocturnal. That's rude. I felt the same way when Gallus first revealed these things to me. I think given time you'll understand what I mean. Okay. For the Nightingale, I've been sworn to secrecy regarding the Sepulchre. I know the Guild doesn't do much to foster faith. But I'm going to have to ask that you continue to trust me. Okay. I'll make for Riften and scout the situation. See if I can discover what Mercer's up to. When you're ready, meet me at the Ragged Flagon. In the meantime, I wanted you to have this. Okay. It belonged to Gallus. I like presents. Given the Everybody likes presents. Simply to prove. If the Guild isn't willing to listen to reason, you might have to. Cool. Ooh, a Nightingale Blade. Let's take a look at this guy, see what we got our hands on here. Whew! That is a Daedric Sword, it looks like. It's very nice. Absorb 25 health and stamina. Wow, that must be what Mercer uses. Because Mercer is always... You always see us doing the health absorb attacks. Alright, so we're not going to start that quest right now. We are going to go get this fishing job done. Because if we're going to the Ragged Flag and I want to turn these quests in. Oh god. Sounds like there's a dragon here. I hope I can just fast travel quickly before this dragon like hostiles me. Come on. Fudge! Yeah. 
Darn it. Winterhold is a pain in the neck place to get dragons for the same reason as other places. There's nowhere for him to land. Uh, another ancient dragon, too. It's going to take another... Oh, see, he can only land on, like, houses. That hit. Ooh, actually, we have March for Death now, too, so that'll be good. That'll actually help a lot if we can get this thing to land. So he's, he's hit with the Mark for Death. Lowers his armor. If I ever can hit him with anything. We should go get all three words of that, really, because it'll help a lot. He's going to keep landing here, but he only lands for, like, a second. I'm pretty bad now. If you just keep circling and landing right there, that'll work out for us. But yeah, sometimes they just go all over the place. Nail them. I really do want one of those dwarven crossbows. I should do that. They just hurt so damn much. And once you get to these higher difficulties, or not higher difficulties, but like higher levels, ah, oh, it landed right away. Got up right away. Oh, here we go. Because it's getting ready to die. Ugh. Just gonna quick save in case I shoot a guard. It'll uh, give me a bounty. So there we go. There we go. You wouldn't, eh? Cool, give me the soul. Nice. Perfect. Alright, off to White Run. Off to White Run to pick some pockets. Actually, the pickpocketing tree, guys, if you guys didn't know this, the pickpocketing tree has one of the best perks in the game. It's just, you know, having perks for it is tough to have. You go here, you go here, and you go, haha, a hundred carrying capacity. That's a lot. Like, that's a, that's a, that's a, that is a crap ton of extra carrying capacity. I love having that perk. It's just hard to get because having spare perks is not an easy thing to do. Oh, man, this is going to be difficult. Just in the middle of the town. What time is it? 6.30, I might have to wait till this bozo goes to bed. Okay, I wonder if I... You trying to hide? Cause I can see you. Shut up. Okay, so 12 hours will be 6 p.m. Let's wait 16 hours, which will be 10.30. Doot. 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 Perfect. Okay, where do you go? Found flower. Cool. Do you ever go to go to bed, Bozo? Okay, he's in a house or something somewhere now. Cool. I like when people are in houses. Houses help. Oh, he's in the Drunken Huntsman. That might not be good. That <laughs> just... cool. see one of these bozos that spends the whole night at the bar. Blade and shadow. Oh, he immediately left. What the hell? Okay, wait. This might be a good opportunity. Who is detecting me? Crap. That was my opportunity, and now I'm being seen. But I needed a quick save, so... Look the other way, Bozo. Can this guy, like, ever go to bed? Okay, I don't know. Guards are detecting me? Is he just looping around? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, cool. Okay, good. He's got a house. That's at least a start. Um, there should be another door, I think. Hopefully. Oh, man. It's going to be one of those things where the guard's constantly watching the door. I can't get in. Oh, no, okay. 
Actually, let's give him a little give him a minute. Because if I break in there and he's just sitting there, he's gonna be like, "Yo, dude, you just breaking into my house?" Like, gotta wait till he's in bed. guys later bachacho perfect all right so now when we head back to the flagging we'll have two more quests to turn in get another thousand gold to add to our unlimited gold i'm gonna call the video there guys thanks for watching the next video we will continue on with the thieves guild main quest we're doing the pursuit thanks for watching guys bye